Hello and welcome to Point of View. Finally, the moment we've all been waiting for. The Shenzhou 13 spacecraft and a brand new crew are on their way to the Chinese space station. The combination of China's Shenzhou 13 crewed spaceship and a Long March 2F carrier rocket blasted off from the Jiuchan Satellite Launch Center in northwestern China today floated outside the Shenzhou 7 spacecraft for 18 minutes as it orbited the Earth. Shenzhou 13 is Yi Guangfu's first mission in space and he will become the 598th person in the world to enter space. The three Taikonauts are set to remain in space for a total of six months in what would be China's longest crewed mission to date. The Shenzhou 13 crew will replace the three-man Shenzhou 12 crew that recently returned home after completing their three-month-long mission to the space station. China plans to have the space station called Tiangong or Heavenly Palace fully crewed and operational by December 2020, an ambitious target for China's rapidly expanding. The country's space program has expanded rapidly over the past decade and has accelerated at a blistering pace in the past year alone. Chinese scientists have successfully landed exploratory rovers on the moon in December last year and on Mars in May this year. Russia, a long-time ISS partner, is also said to be leaving the project, is now considering launching its own space station by 2030. With the International Space Station set to retire in the coming years, China's space station will become the only one in Earth's orbit. Let me know in the comment section how excited you are about China's recent space missions, especially the Shenzhou 13 launch. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.